We've got the finale of an unforgettable weekend in Kansas City. It's the one seed, Baylor, taking on two-seeded West Virginia. Well, they love to get up and down in transition. So does West Virginia on Monday night. And it was a close game through three quarters. And then West Virginia had three players foul out. Today, you know, really a bounce back game, Brenda, because she didn't play well in the quarters. And there's KK Deans right on cue. The Haas in 19. And these players still playing for those seniors that missed out on a chance to repeat their national championship. Personally, I think they're a one seed. We'll see how it shakes up. But that's a really nice feed. Jasmine Carson getting downhill, lays it up. That's a big boost off, big, off West Virginia. Carrington lines one up for three, and Baylor hits. Here comes Dijanae Carrington, lost it right to Egbo, and Moon Urson, are you kidding me? The primary reason why she was named Big 12 first team. What a move by Queen Egbo. Edge of four, screens Moon Urson, who goes right through it. Dean steps back and splashes it from the top of the key. It keeps her off balance a little bit. West Virginia trying to put a couple buckets together. Jasmine Carson and foul from behind. Five point game in the Big 12 Championship Final. Carrington, Ooh. oh my goodness, with the switch of the hands and the flip. E. Richards back to Bickle. Five to shoot, Bickle tucks it and lays it up and in. Baylor goes into Queen Egbo right out of the gates as she gets a strong position. I told myself I would live to see the day when these Baylor fans were more excited about what's on the court than getting... You get excited a lot about what happens on the court for Baylor. Gondrzec, the distance. After that, that great win for West Virginia, she said, it's March, baby. Nalissa Smith. Down under a minute to go against K-State, and she hit a huge three-pointer. I mean, you could just see how much she wanted to be out on the court. Three seconds to go in the third quarter. Can they get a bucket, a little momentum? Kaiser gets the roll. A huge basket for the Mountaineers. She's cheering for Moon, and there she gets another. Moon, Urson, and Melissa Smith out in front. Moon's going to take it herself and lay it up. Remember, she was... You know, they built this lead without her in the first half. Look at all the Baylor jerseys. Carrington, over the top, no. Queen Egbo, yes. An offensive rebound and second chance point. Rises up, Melissa Smith chasing, and 40 can still get it done. Moon Urson! In a Nyblack, good feed, and a nice finish from Kari Nyblack. And administering COVID tests and helping these players stay healthy throughout the course of the season. And to everybody as we finish up here in Kansas City. Pickle for three. Nine of the last 10 championships belong to Kim Mulkey and company in Waco. They beat West Virginia by 26. Thanks for joining us, everyone. What a weekend it has been.